Yo, it's your boy the Android Doctor back again with another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the Resurrection Remix ROM onto the Motorola Moto G third generation 2015 model. So, um, this is where you download the ROM from. But before you download it, we're just going to have a little look at the features. So, these are the main features which are included with the ROM. So I'll just take time and scroll through so you can have a look at all the features. If I've scrolled through a bit too fast you can just pause the video and um, have a better look. Okay so what you need to do is before you try to install this onto your device, you will need to have an unlocked bootloader. You'll also need root access um, in order for you to install this. If you don't know how to unlock the bootloader or how to root, I'll leave a link to my two tutorials in the description down below. Um, just follow those two videos and you should have the bootloader unlocked and rooted in no time. Um, so like I said, I'll leave the link to my tutorials in the description down below. Um, the next thing you'll need to do is you'll need to go ahead and hit this link here and download the ROM. And then also hit this link and download the G apps. So you need to download both these two files here. Once you download them, just store them on your desktop. So I've got both files here. So I've got G apps there and I've got the resurrection ROM there. Then the next thing you'll need to do is you'll need to install TWRP Recovery. So I'll leave a link to TWRP Recovery in the description down below down there. So just go ahead and download it um, by clicking on this link here. So click on this link and download TWRP Recovery and start it on your desktop also. So this is TWRP Recovery, this is it here. So just make sure you've got all three of these files on your desktop. Okay, so when you unlock the bootloader, you will have used ADB Minimal Fastboot to unlock the bootloader. So you will still have that installed on your C drive. So just go to it. So it should be, by default, it should be on, it should be in the program files x86 folder and scroll down and you should see it there, minimal ADB and fastboot. Let's just move that out of the way for now. Okay, so what you need to do is just drag and drop the TWRP file into there and just go ahead and hit continue and there it is. Okay, next thing you need to do is connect your phone to the USB cable like I've already done. And open up your phones, I mean open up the access to the SD card on your phone and just drag and drop the gapps file and the resurrection file, both those files onto your phone's SD card. So I've already put both files on there, there they both are, if you look, gapps and resurrection remix. And you can go ahead and just close that down. Okay, so what we need to do now is we just need to flash the TWRP recovery. So go back to minimal ADB. Okay. 
okay so just press shift and right click on your mouse find the blank space sorry in here just find a blank space any blank space and press shift and right click on your mouse okay until you see this option here open command window here okay now just unplug your phone and power it off hit power off now we're going to go into fast boot mode so we can flash the TWRP recovery so to go into fast boot mode you just press the volume down button here along with the power so just press volume down and power so press both of those for roughly about three seconds and then let go and now you should be in fast boot mode as you can see here let me just focus fast boot flash mode okay now go back to where you downloaded the TWRP recovery from and you're just gonna copy this fastboot boot TWRP osprey 2.8.7 test1.image so just hit copy there and now go back to that little command window now just connect your phone to the USB cable so I'm just going to put the camera down real quick and do that okay so once you've connected it to the USB cable we're just going to paste that command what we just copied into there Let's see if I can just focus again god this camera is terrible for, to for, for focusing ok there it is so just paste it into there it should say fast boot boot TWRP Osprey 2.8.7 test.image now just go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard and it should flash the TWRP recovery image and the phone should now boot into TWRP recovery you can go ahead and unplug it okay so now we're just going to install the ROM so go ahead and hit wipe and now swipe across where it says swipe to factory reset so just go ahead and swipe to factory reset and it should say successful go ahead and hit back hit the back button here now select install by default if you're using TWRP for the first time it, it might be on internal storage but you'll need to select micro SD because that's where you stored the ROM so to change it just tap up here until you see the micro SD card option and um, now you should see your ROM so here it is resurrection remix ROM just go ahead and tap on it now swipe to confirm flash and now it's going to install the ROM
Okay, so it's finished flashing. It should say successful. Just go ahead and hit the home button here and then hit install again. Now we're going to go ahead and install G apps. So here is G apps. And then once again, just swipe to confirm flash. And it should say successful again as you can see there at the top successful now just go ahead and reboot system And we've got the Resurrection Remix boot animation there. Okay, so the first boot might take a while, so just be patient, go make yourself a cup of tea. So it says upgrade in progress, initializing resources, optimizing 22 out of 98 applications powered by Android 5.1.1. While that's optimizing, you can go ahead and close all this down because we've finished here. <clears throat> okay, so it's almost finished optimizing. 75 of 98 apps left. Grading contacts, finishing boot. Okay, so we can grant super user access, United Kingdom. Okay, so we're just going to go through the whole setup process real quick. Okay. Put my Wi-Fi password in.
checking connection this can take a while come on okay so back again um if if you get stuck on um that part what I was just stuck on a few seconds ago just disconnect from your Wi-Fi and then continue you know the part where, where it says this might take a while just um, disconnect from your Wi-Fi and then continue because it was taking forever so um, here it is this is Resur Resurrection Remix ROM on the Motorola Moto G third gen Here it is, Resurrection, version Okay, so with this you can add some themes to it if you want. I think I'll put a few themes on later. So yeah, this was just my quick tutorial video showing you how to install the Resurrection Remix ROM onto the third generation Motorola Moto G. If this video helped you out, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave any comments in the comment section down below if you need, um, if you get stuck with anything and you need any help. Um, leave your comments, let me know, asking for help and I'll be sure to respond whenever I can. Um, also, if you want to see more videos like this on how to install ROMs onto this phone, um, please let me know in the comment section and um, I'll try to put up more videos um, if there's any kind of ROM if there's any particular type of ROM you want to see me install um, let me know the name of the ROM and I'll try and do the video so yeah thanks for watching it's your boy the Android Doctor and I'm out doses